Hi, Cartes Ross here with tshirtriches.com. Today I'm going to show you a unique way that you can literally get into the t-shirt printing business um, by making t-shirts yourself at home. And it all starts with a machine um, like the one you see here, which is called a t-shirt transfer machine or a heat press. And essentially a heat press basically allows you to take some of your designs, some of your ideas, your sayings and whatnot, put them onto a special type of paper and you're able to use this machine to transfer the design from the paper to your t-shirt. And just to give you an idea, um, just to show you an, ex an example of such, this is a shirt that was made with this machine. We essentially took a transfer paper, and I'll show you that in just a moment. But we took this paper, um, we laid it on top of the t-shirt, we clamped it down on this machine, and it was transferred to the shirt. But this is just an idea, just to give you an idea of some of the things you can make with it. Um, this is a one of our guys here made this design, um, an Obama Martin Luther King shirt, and he made this design with the uh, t-shirt process that I'm going to talk to you about today. Um, just to give you an idea, um, again, here's another design. Again, you can make your own design, you can make family reunion designs, you can make t-shirts or jerseys for basketball teams and whatnot, and uh, just a whole lot of things you can do with this machine. And just to give you an idea, this machine here, weighs about 40, 50 pounds, um, it heats up to about 500 degrees, and um, it's like a big hot iron, and again, it allows you to transfer your designs um, from a paper to a t-shirt, and so what I'm doing, I'm just going to lay this shirt down here just to give you an example, and to show you this here, this here is, is actually a transfer paper, this is the transfer, essentially you put your design um, onto this special release paper, and you print it, you lay it down on the shirt, and what we're going to do, we're just going to lay this down here just to show you how it works, and we're going to clamp this machine down. And again, it stays on for about eight seconds um, on the shirt, and again, the heat is going to transfer that design from the paper to the t-shirt. And what you'll have is a unique t-shirt. I thought the And so what we do, we just peel the design off. And once with the transfer paper, once you use it, once the design is transferred, you can no longer use it. So that design, so this transfer paper is a one-time use. And so what you get here is your t-shirt. And again, you can make a variety. So if you have your own special sayings, uh, if you have some family reunion shirts, so if you want to get into the t-shirt business, printing local t-shirts for local businesses or schools in your area, um, or even use the internet to sell your t-shirt ideas, um, you can do that with this machine. And again, I got a transfer paper. I like to fold mine up just to find the center point. T-shirt paper, we're going to transfer it here. We're going to lay it down, and we're going to clamp it down. And normally, you let this stay on for about uh, anywhere from 6 seconds to 8 seconds to 10 seconds. And... Uh, some of the machines will have a buzzer after eight seconds or 10 seconds, they'll beep and go off. And, uh, but here I'm just doing this from experience. I know how long to let them stay on. And again, the transfer design is, is gone for this paper. Now, this is not the type of transfer paper that you buy from the store, uh, from Walmart or whatever, and run through your own printer. Um, it's a special process that you go through to get these shirts made. And let's see here. It's a special process that you go through. You generally send it out, and these different companies will put these designs onto the paper. The types that you get from the store are real cheap. They, uh, when you run them through the washing machine, they'll, when you try to print your own designs, they'll break off, um, fade, smudge, smear, and all that good stuff. So those are not the type of stuff you want to use. In fact, a lot of screen printers um, we took one of these shirts to a screen printer, a lot of them would have a difficult time being able to tell the difference on whether or not it was screen printed. But when they put the designs into this paper, it's actually done by a screen printing process. So again, you can make all types of shirts, just to show you that. Body piercing saved my life. And we specialize, we were in the religious market, and we make a lot of t-shirts for the uh, different churches, fundraisers and whatnot. So the opportunity again is wide open. This transferred from the TV show uh, Survivor and as you notice the design is inverted backwards or mirrored so that way when you put it onto the shirt it comes out the right way.
and this here was one of our top selling t-shirts again after the show survivor um, one of our highly highly purchased t-shirts and you can do this but as you see the machine is small enough that you can do it from home um, in a spare bedroom you don't need a lot of room to uh, make the shirts um, you know so it's, it's, it's just it's so much you can do and in just a moment I'm going to show you some of the different jerseys uh, that that you can uh, make with this machine is is essentially unlimited, literally unlimited, and we've printed tens of thousands and thousands of shirts with machine with this machine, and sold them all online. Sold them at different fundraisers. Some people sold them at church concerts. Um, different parades and events and you and again you can use this to print onto dark colored shirts as well so it's not that you just have to stick with white but so if you have creative ideas if you have designs that you want some ideas that you think you can put out to the market and kind of test this is this is the best way the most affordable way to get into the business screen printing you generally spend thousands and thousands of dollars on equipment um, uh, inks is messy, um, cost a lot more money to get started with screen printing, and quite frankly, like I said earlier, uh, the, this, the design that you see here is actually created by a screen printing process. They put onto this special release paper, so essentially you are getting screen printed shirts, but you're not having to deal with all the, all the mess and time involved with getting, getting started. Um, this design here that you're about to see is another one of, one of our highly popular shirts that were sold on the net. And let's see here. And one of my favorite shirts as well. So as you see, you can print a variety of t-shirts, different shot sizes, shapes, designs, and colors. And with that, I'm just gonna show you some of the local teams. If you have a football team or a basketball team, you can make a uh, football shirt, jersey, and like I say, we can definitely help you out with that. We have a bunch of tools and resources available to help get you going. And, um, and as you scroll down below on our website at tshirtriches.com, you'll be able to see the different um, programs we have available to help you get going in this business. Uh, aprons, if you have, this here is for a restaurant, a gondolier restaurant I don't know if you can see that but this is an apron and let me bring it in closer gondolier pizza Italian restaurant but you can make an apron and do all kinds of stuff with this machine also we have uh, again shirts you can make these for some of the softball teams cheerleader uniforms you can do it all and basketball teams um, I mean we got everything you can use this machine for, for literally any and everything. Sweaters, wintertime, uh, football teams and whatnot. You know, so if you're looking to get started in the t-shirt business and you like step by step on showing you how to get into that process, visit our website at www.tshirtriches.com. My name is Cartes Ross. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to give us an email and uh, use some of the contact methods below and we'll be glad to help you out. Thank you very much. Have a great day.